Welcome back team. So this is the start of two videos about inheritance. Now inheritance really gives object oriented programming its immense power. In this video I'm going to show you how we can make one class inherit from another class. So we'll make webcam class inherit from camera class. I'll then show you how we can make those VIs for override so it can implement some functionality. So let's have a look on how to do that. So I've already created the webcam class. I'm going to right click that and go to properties. I'll bring up the class properties window. Now let's head over to inheritance. At the moment it's inheriting from LaVey object. But let's change the inheritance. Let's make it inherit from camera.lv class. So I choose camera.lv class and inherit from selected. Just to show you this graphically, we have LaVey object at a very top level, then camera class, then webcam class. So now webcam inherits from camera, we can go new, then VI for override, and all of the dynamic dispatch methods from the parent class appear here. Let's select all of them and click OK. By doing this, LaVey is going to create for us lots of VIs for override. So you can see four of them appearing here. Now let's select one of these, initialize camera.vi and start implementing some functionality. So let's implement some functionality here to well, initialize our camera. Now that we have our uh, functionality here, I want to be able to pass that camera reference to the next one along in our API. How do we do that? Well, we're going to use the object. Now an object is a single instance of a class. It's the wire at the top of the VI. So I'm going to bundle that data with the object so I can pass it along through my API.